This morning, British troops have been deployed to all major cities in Scotland. The outcome of the recent referendum election revealed a landslide victory for the SNP, and we can now confirm that the UK government has declared civil war in a decision to overturn the election result. This is a red alert. We strongly advise all citizens to remain in their homes until further notice. Leave now, John. Seek out the hermit. John, I want you to stay calm after what I tell you next. Have you been to the dentist in the last few years, since all this began? Did they tell you that you needed a felon? John, they lied to you. For the last three years, the British Secret Service have been keeping watch on all its citizens tracking their movements through a satellite. They predicted this war would happen a long time ago. And a long time ago, they decided they needed to know the whereabouts of the public at all times, in case they intended to take, or needed even to take, drastic measures. John, when they gave you that filling, they implanted a tracking device into your tooth. They know you're here, John. And for what we're about to do, they can't know you're here. So we need to take it out. We need to take out the implant. You're insane! Don't touch me, I'm leaving. Relax, John. What I say is true. You know that. You knew you had to come here, didn't you, John? Something inside you told you where to go. That you had to find me. You need to trust me, John. Let me do this, and quickly. We have important work we need to do. I'm afraid there's more, John. There is a reason I, I made you wear the blindfold this entire time. There's a second device, John. It's in your eye. Remember those eye exams the government issued everyone to take? Two years ago, it's free. Don't worry. Some story about surveying the nation's visual health. It's been in your eye ever since. They implanted it when they scanned your eyeball. This is what they used to see you, John. They can track you 
where you are, what you care about, the people you love, the newspapers you read, the ideas you have. That's what it all comes down to, John. They need to know you aren't a threat to them and that you believe the things they're they told you to believe. We have to take it out, John. Then they lose all the control they have over you. John, I need you to drink this. You've done well, John. The painful part is over. Now it's time to talk about your powers, how to use them. We'll do great things, John. Together we can bring peace to Earth. I don't understand, though. What's so important about me? You really have no idea, do you? Your abilities, what you're capable of. I picked up your presence when I was meditating. <coughs> this orb was gifted to me on a visit to Edinburgh 20 years ago by a very wise old seer. Just at the time of your birth. I watched you grow and witnessed the tactics and treatment of you by the Government Secret Service. But now I'm going to help you unlock your true powers. I knew who you were and what you could do and that you had to come to me for me to guide you.
I want you to close your eyes, relax your body and empty your mind. Feel the energy in your core and expand it. Reach out and with your mind's eye try to see your home. I'm, I'm scared by what I see and I'm, I'm afraid I'm afraid I can't I, I can't do anything about it. Damn! The tracking devices. They must know when they've been tampered with. They know you pulled them out. They know you know their purpose. So they're here to eliminate you. We don't have much time, John. I need you to bring down the helicopter. Reach out with your mind again. Focus your energy and imagine a hand physically pulling out the engine. can't bring down the helicopter. Yes, John, you can. You need to trust in your power and believe you can do it. Hurry, we don't have much time. You've done well. We still have much to do. We need to send the government a message. There's something they can't ignore.